Right, I don't usually let my chains get this rusty, but I finished the Festive 500 a few days ago, and uh, I just let it fester in the garage for a few days. No problem though, let's get on it. By the way, you'll need these. There's plenty of other YouTube videos showing you how to use them. Thanks for watching. it how you don't do it basically just clean your drive tank train how you think you should clean it but this is just to show you don't need ultrasonic cleaners you don't need flashy park tool widgets that clip on the chain I've used everything I've used all kind of degreasers finish line citrus all other brands of different degreasers well tech or whatever you know if you got a bit of petrol a bit of turp lying around some washing up liquid preferably lemon some sort of citrus cleaner to cut the grease that's all you need to do. Get stuck in with the toothbrushes and what other brushes you think you need. Any corrosion on there, just scrape it off, clean it up, wipe it with a rag, put some GT85 on there, put it back together, job done. Half these people showing stuff on YouTube, I mean, they might be able to ride bikes, but when it comes to mechanics and stuff, they don't have flaff around. So that's just a simple way of doing it. Try it for yourself. And also, people can't afford some of this stuff, man. Ultrasonic cleaners? I mean, come on, man, what are they? 100, 500 bucks or whatever, totally not needed. You're plugging it in as well, using like up electricity, which is, again, not needed. It's just crazy. So this is just one way of many cleaning a drive chain. 
Thanks for watching. <laughs>